everybody and welcome back to another Dragon Ball Legends video and today we are going to talk about the new tag unit Super Saiyan 2 and Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Trunks and Vegeta and uh, they're all of their basic abilities and to talk, we are also going to talk about uh, what teams they could be good at and uh, what, how their kit is, if it's good or not or if it could be in better or it could be in worse we are going to be interesting to talk about that in this video. So with that being said, let's uh, watch the video, shall we? Oh, okay. So Trunks and Vegeta are range type. Or uh, to be precise, Trunks is the rage type, while Vegeta is the strike based. Hmm. Because usually when they attack, they usually are the opposite of what they are. So um, Super Saiyan 2 Trunks is the yellow. So you start with Trunks. Then you have Vegeta. That is the reverse yellow. That is strong against red, but weaker against purple. While Trunks is strong against purple and weak against red. And the tag is Vegeta Clan, Hybrid Saiyan, Future, Super Saiyan 2, Saiyan, God Key, and Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan. And is in the Future Trunks Saga. Okay, okay, I see it, I see it. I feel like this is a good uh, thing. Uh, a lot of tags, that means a lot of equipment options and uh, what teams they can be on. Okay, let's look at the kid. His C ability is 30%. Uh, if it's a six star, you're supposed to saying six star. 30% to tag future Vegeta clan or hybrids. Oh my God, it buffs hy hybrids, <laughs> okay. And 15% to tag Vegeta clan strike defense. Okay, okay, so blast attack and defense. And then additional Vegeta Clan strike defense. Okay, okay. That looks pretty good. Okay, okay. So let's check the strike guard, shall we? Uh, slice damage. Okay. Oh no, slice I mean. Minus five to own special move art cards for 15 time accounts on hit. Oh! I mean, that could be pretty good. If their focus on is on the blue card, like all the tags have been so far, then uh, yeah, it could be pretty good. Like uh, if you have short uh, blue. Okay, last arts. 180% damage inflicted? Wait, if I remember correctly, there is a unit, uh, I think it's the Senkai Gogeta and Piccolo that has 200% damage inflicted against blast armor, but a tag that has that? Oh my god. Oh my god, it's gonna hurt a lot. Ooh. A powerful blast that can inflict major damage to blast armor. Okay, okay. Well, it could be pretty useful to abuse. Okay, let's check the next art, shall we? The green card. Draw a special art to card next. Activate twice. Oh, so you can get the up to twice blue card. Okay. Restore on key by 50. Oh, that's a lot. I take it. If the green card costs like 14, like everybody else, then that is a lot of key. 30% of damage inflicted for 10 time accounts. Oh, that's pretty strong. Cancel own attribute downgrade and abnormal condition. Yes, totally need that. Especially against Hercule, bleeding, and other stuff. You know what I mean by Hercule. Paralyze. <laughs> Applies the following effect to self based on own remaining health. Okay. Health is between 50% and 30%. Restore health by 10% and restore vanishing gaze by 50. Okay, so if you are, if your health is below, uh, is uh, between 50 and 30, you get 10% health back and vanishing gaze by 50. And if the health and the second part health is below 30%, you heal 15% instead and vanishing gaze restore by 70. I feel like you can abuse this, like, a lot, holy. The green car restored van- is this no limit to this? Because if the- you can- if you have a green car, you can just keep restoring. That's pretty good. I feel like it's a Kid Boo green card. Also you get two blue cards. Okay, the blue card, deal massive impact damage. Blast armor when charging forward. Draw a blast card next. Okay, okay, so wait, you get a blast card immediately after you use a blue card? Okay, 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 okay. 
I see you. I see you. I see you. 40% of special move damage inflicted for three time accounts. Okay. Applies attribute upgrade minus 40% to enemy sustained damage cut effect to self for three time accounts. Oh. Well, that is pretty good, especially with the amplified what he has. And nullify enemy restored own health when we reach zero. Oh, yes. Nullify endurance. That is perfect. Dude, everyone should have that because there is so much endurance unit right now. It's insane. Okay. His unique first ability. The following effect occurs when battle starts or when this character enters the battlefield through attack switch. 90% of damage inflicted cannot be cancelled. 30% of damage inflicted for 20 time accounts. Also, oh, if you for the tw additional 20 time accounts, he will have 120 damage counts. Damage? Oh, no, not counts. 120% damage. Okay, reduce damage received by 60%. That is a lot. Oh, no, that is a lot. That's the highest so far, I think. 60. There is no higher than 60, I think. Minus 5 to own Blast Art. That means the Blast Art will cost 24 each time you use it. That is, go that is good. 15% damage and Blast Damage inflicted by allies. Tag future. Okay, okay. So if you swap your allies to get immediately 15% to Blast Damage. Nice. 15% to Strike Damage inflicted by ally tag Vegeta Clan. Oh, so... If you have Vegeta Clan, it buffs uh, the Vegeta Clan strike damage. But if you have Future, it goes uh, for the Future and for the Blast damage part. But if you have both of them, it, it, they get all the buffs. Okay, okay, I see it. The effect resets when tax switches to Vegeta. Okay, okay. So it, it is uh, if uh, it occurs a battle start or when Vegeta switched to Trunks. Okay, okay. That's pretty good so far. Applies the following okay. Well, it's still the unique one. Okay. Applies the following effect to sell once 20 time accounts have a last from battle start or after entering the battlefield through a tag. That means that after 20 time accounts, he will get all of this. Or if he sw if he trunks enters through a tag switch through Vegeta. Restore health by 10%. Oh my god. Okay. Uh <laughs> Uh, 70% damage inflicted cannot be cancelled. Oh my god, with additional 120% this, there's 190% damage inflicted. If you are in the tag, if you are in trunk side. Huh. But that is for 20 time accounts. Uh, so, but still, if we're thinking about this, it is still... There's still 160 damage inflicted, even if we don't... Think about the 20 time accounts. Minus 5 to art cost. Oh, so the blast art cost 19 while the strike damage costs 14 then. And the blue card. Oh my god. Mmm. They were pretty good. And all it all resets when they switch to Vegeta? What does Vegeta have then? Okay, okay. But this is just the first ability. Okay. Second unique ability. Knocks the enemy back to long range if a cover chain is performed against their blast art attack. Activate during assist. Combo art, special move art. Okay, so you can only combo uh, through a uh, blue card. And that is uh, pretty good. Because I know <laughs> if you have other cards, would kind of be broken. Applies the following effect to sell when this, car this character uses a blast art. Restore key by 10. Oh, okay. Applies buff effect nullify enemy special action that activates when changing cover for two time accounts. Oh, so he has cover now on the first blast art? Oh, for two time accounts? That is pretty good. So you can use the uh, change two blast cards and then just go combo. Oh my god. Activation card resets when this character switch or attacks with is performed. Okay, okay. So if he switch out from the... To, from the party to another unit, or if it tags switch, it's going to reset. Okay, okay. So, hmm. That was pretty good so far. Dude, bro, this Trunks is going to do a lot of damage. Especially now, uh, this Trunks of Vegeta in total, because they have those units. They are going to be, because of the tags, they have so far four units that can Senkai buff them. 
So with the ability of um, Goku Black, the old uh, Senkai, that is buff future. We have God Vegeta from the movies that uh, buff God Key because of the Vegeta side. And then we have Super Saiyan 4, Legends Limited Goku that buffs Saiyans. And then we have the Super Vegeta that also buffs uh, Saiyans with their Senkai ability. So this guy can have four times Senkai buff if he wanted. And with all the buffs he has on this, ooh, it's gonna be interesting. Okay, okay, okay. It's still the unique too? How long is this text? Okay. <clears throat> the following effect occur upon landing a blast art hit. Draw a blast card next, activate twice. Oh my god, this is Vegito Blue, but for blast art. Oh my god. Activation count reset when character switch or attack switch is performed. This is literally Vegito Blue, but <laughs> but with the blast. Okay, uh, because Vegeta Blue gets strike cards each time he hits with the strike cards. But uh, this Trunks gets the blast art activated twice. So, um, yeah, it will be devastating, especially when this is a blast unit. Oh, it's future blast coming back to the meta. Inflict all enemy attribute downgrade 30 to all art costs for three time accounts. 30? Bro, that is devastating. <laughs> what? Oh, that's only hitting with the blast arch? Bro, the card. Wait, this feels like it's Golden Frieza. Because I know Golden Frieza increases the uh, art card if it hits with the blast card, too. I uh, remember the 99 arch card on strike uh, and blast and stuff. Oof. Okay, the third thing inflict enemy with attribute downgrade. 80% to uh, minus 80% to health restoration for three time accounts. Oh, that's pretty good. I mean, if you face heal units like uh, if you face future Gohan, other units, or themselves, well, they cannot heal a lot uh, more than they want to. Okay, the following effects occur if own remaining health is 50% or below after being hit by an enemy arts card. Okay, randomly destroys one of your own card and draws a green card next. Actually, it was. Okay, so after an enemy. After an enemy uses an art card and your health is just below 50%, you just immediately get a green card, though it only activates once. Okay. Two, plus 10% to own health restoration for 15 time accounts. Okay, okay. Shortens ally substitution counts by five. Activate once. Oh. 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 Okay. Oh my god, you can abuse this. Reduce enemy's key by 80. Uh, so this is activate once okay okay so he has a small small pen kit there because pen reduce count like 15 um, key each time she gets a hit but as soon as this guy loses 50% uh, and less HP uh, he he will do all of this you get a green more health restoration shorten your counts and reduce enemies key by 80 you're stopping their combo unless they have a main ability and stuff or switch to gain key okay i see it oh my god i see you trunks i see you okay the switch ability requirement max switch gate tag switches to vegeta reverse own element factors restores own health by 10 percent and key by 20. Okay, okay. Dude, I feel like this guy is healing a lot. Holy. Plus 10% to damage inflicted for 30 time accounts. Oh, randomly destroys two enemy cards. Oh, pretty good. Dude, I, I kind of... The healing part, I feel like it's a lot with this unit. But holy. Especially if you have it with Pan. Okay, let's look at the Vegeta's. He has the same strike uh, card that the... Uh, Minus 5 to own special move art cards for 50 time account. The blast is the same. I see 180% damage inflicted against blast armor. Okay, the green card. Restore own key by 40. That is 10 less than uh, trunks. You get a blast card art next. Okay. You get uh, plus 10% damage inflicted for 30 time accounts. Okay, 10. Okay, castle own, that, that is the same too. The following effect occurs based on own remaining health. If it's between 50 or 30, restore all health by 10%. Randomly destroys one enemy card. Oh, oh, so if Vegeta gets the combo, like if, as soon as 50 or 30, you destroy enemy cards to try to stop their combos. 
The same as uh, with the health there, but it destroys two instead. So if you're if 50 or 30 and then suddenly become 30, destroy additional two cards. That was pretty good. And you heal a lot too. Hmm. The, the healing part is kind of nuts. Okay, okay, okay. The blue card. Deal massive impact damage. Blast armor when cha charging forward. Okay. Oh, the blue card has blast armor. You get a blast dark card. Okay, that's the same with the trunks. That is also the same. Okay, the entire thing is the same as trunks. The blue card has the same abilities. It's just that the animation is different. Okay, the following of when this character enters the battle th battlefield through a switch. Okay. 90% of the damage inflicted cannot be cancelled. Reduce damage received by 60%. Oh, this Vegeta has card draw speed. Increase own arc card draw speed by one level. Cannot be cancelled. Okay, okay, okay. Minus 10 to own blast arc card. Oh, so this guy has Im immediately 19. Okay, plus 50 to blast damage inflicted future. Strike damage to the attack Vegeta clan. That's the same as the trunks. But the card draw speed, oh, I feel like the Vegeta will not get the arch card then. I feel like it's only Trunks that get the, the blast art. Oh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. So far, I like the unit a lot. Oh, there, here, here. Apply the unique ability, it's still first the unique ability. <laughs> Applies the following effect to sell every time this car character uses an art card. Okay, so if you use any art cards, this happens. It gives you a five key. 10% of damage inflicted for 5 time accounts and 10% da damage inflicted for 30 time accounts. Oh, so you get 20 first to the 5 time accounts and then you still have the 10 for additional 30. Hmm, that's pretty good. Plus the following effect to self after enemy attack is over. After enemy attack is over, okay. The 10% damage inflicted for 30 time account, restore health by 10%, activates 4 times. This unit heals a lot, what the heck? Okay, 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 I'll see you. Bro, if you if you run like a double yellow with this, future Gohan, and someone in the leader, and you have the bench of EX Piccolo that gives a lot of health restoration, that would be a lot of healing. Okay, okay, I see I see how, how they're doing this. I see how they're doing this. Okay, the second ability. Knocks enemy back to long range if a cover chain is performed against their strike arch attack. Activates during assist. Okay, on strike. Okay, so Vegeta has the combo of the strike arch. Applies the following effect to sell when this character uses a blast arch. Okay, applies the uh, buff effect. Oh, he has the, the he has that uh, blast uh, cover thing uh, too. Nullifies cover or blast uh, for two time account. Activate once and then it resets. So if you use from Vegeta, then switch to Trunks. This kept using blast card and. They still get hit because they cannot cover at least for the two. Because if you use the blast card, like get two, bla uh, one blast, and then switch to trunks and use blast again, they cannot cover the um, four time accounts. That would be great. Ten percent damage inflicted for three thirty time accounts when. Uh... Okay, when this girl uses a blast. Okay, and everything resets afterwards. Okay, second unique ability. The following effects occur upon landing a blast on hit. Reduce enemy's key by 30. Inflict all enemies with attribute downgrade. Okay, so the only difference is about this blast card is he doesn't get the, the bla additional blast arts. He reduces keys instead when using a blast. But that's because he has card draw speed, while Trunks doesn't have the card draw speed. Okay, I see it, I see it. The following effect occur if enemy's health, uh, if own remaining health is 50% or below after being hit by an enemy arch card. Randomly destroys one of your own card and draws a green card. Okay, that's the same as strong. 10% only has restoration. That is 5% uh, less, I think, if I remember correctly when I checked here. Uh, let me check here real quick. Yeah. No, that's the same. Okay, never mind. Uh, shorter as sub covered by five. Okay, that is exactly the same as Trunks' ability then. Okay, if uh, tr Vegeta switches to Trunks, this happens. Tax switch to Trunks, reverse element factor, heal, key, gets a blast card, restore own vanish engage by 70. Oh, so, okay, that is pretty clever. Because if you switch from Vegeta to Trunks, restore vanish, and use a green card, 
You have your entire vanishing gauge back again. Okay, that is pretty clever. Okay, okay, okay. I, I think I understand what the concept about this is. Okay, but I, I really like the unit. And with all the Senkai buff he has, I feel like this is going to be a really good thing. Oh, yeah. It's going to be interesting. So, with that being said, guys, uh, thank you all for watching and discussing on this. The teams will be interesting. He'll probably be on future. They are Vegeta clans. But since this guy is a blast based or more like range type focused unit, it will be interesting because he can be on diff so many different teams because he's hybrids, because he's. Uh, He's Vegeta clan, he's a Saiyan, he's a god. Like, yeah, there's so many tags on this unit, so. With that being said, Balamore here talked about the, the tags is done uh, for today. If you do like the video, though, do give a like. There's the like button right down there. Follow all our social media on the links down below. Or if you have a comment on the bio of the video, then yeah, write down in the comments. You can say whatever you want, so have fun with it. Just uh, try to be easy with it. So with that being said, Balamore out. Peace.